Succumb. Thousands of Tigers fans gathered at the Liberty Bowl to watch today's game. Continuing our team coverage tonight in the Tigers' den is local 24 News reporter Rudy Williams. Rudy was there as fans cheered on the Tigers. Rudy, what's the feeling like today? Well, unfortunately, the cheering going on at the Liberty Bowl was not enough to edge the 8-5 and five Tigers on to victory. But Tigers fans will get another chance to cheer their team in a bowl game to soon be announced. Now, although denied a championship title, Tiger mania lives on another day. In that group of enthusiastic Tigers fans are 1998 Olympic gold medalist in boxing, Kennedy McKinney, and Cedric Wilson, a player on the 2005 Super Bowl winning team, Pittsburgh Steelers. This is where I grew up and I was born and raised. I've, all, I've always been a Tiger fan and it's, just, it's, it's, a, it's an honor to be here today and That's to right. support the Tigers. The two champs and their crew tailgate on Tiger Lane for all the Tigers football games. However, the Tigers would be denied the AAC championship title yet another year. Inside the Liberty Bowl, fans took the field excited over their Tigers winning success this season and what looked like a great start towards a championship win. Well, as you can see, hundreds of fans came out to the Liberty Bowl today to cheer on the Tigers. And look, they got the best seat in the house. What better way to cheer on the Memphis Tigers? Well, despite the game's outcome, many say there's lots to celebrate when it comes to Memphis football. You know, 10 years ago, we could not have gotten this many people to see an out-of-town game at the Liberty Bowl, and um, it's, just, it's just fun and exciting. It means a lot for the university, and it's a great season, and it's a great way to end the season. Go Tigers, go! Well, today's game was sponsored by Mayor Strickland and his fellow Memphis alumni. Tonight, you may hear rumors of what bowl game the Tigers will play in later, but the official word on that comes out tomorrow. In the studio tonight, I'm Rudy Williams, Local 24 News.